Hello movie lovers, Bob for Bob's movie review here, and today I'm bringing my unboxing and review of Hard Bodies on Blu-ray. Be sure to click subscribe and click on the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload great new content. If you enjoy the video, be sure to show it some love and give it a like rating. This one includes Blu-ray, hard bodies. That's like a sunscreen or something, I guess, suntan lotion. I've never seen this one. I really don't know anything about it. It is from Mill Creek Entertainment. I think there was at least one sequel to this too. So <laughs> it did well enough that they made a second. If you don't know what they are, you don't know what you're missing. Okay. When three middle-aged, <laughs> three middle-aged geezers, what the heck? Since when is middle-aged a geezer? Like, what is going on here? Move into a swinging beach house. They hire a young stud to teach them how to score with the local beauties. 80s band Vixen and hundreds of Southern California's hottest swimsuit models co-star in the legendary cult comedy. Huh, this one is rated R. Region A Locked has a one hour and 27 minute runtime. This one's from uh, 1984. Here's the inside. I don't really ever remember seeing this movie. Like... I don't know. I mean, not like, I just don't really remember seeing the movie around. You know, sometimes there's movies you haven't seen, but I remember seeing it on the Hastings shelf before they closed, you know, stuff like that. Uh, if you guys have seen it, love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. Let's check out the inside. And there we have the disc, same artwork as the cover. All right, guys, I got to check out Hard Bodies. This one is rated R, has a one hour and 28 minute runtime. It is a comedy. It's directed by Mark Griffiths, and it stars Grant Kramer, Teal Roberts, Gary Wood, Michael Rappaport, Sorrells Pickard, Roberta Collins, and Cindy Silver. <laughs> All right, so I had never, yeah, I don't think I'd ever heard of this one, like I said, uh, before watching this. And it kind of reminds me of those kind of 80s style uh, like they always took place at, at the ski resort and they were kind of these fl flimsy stories and they were, they were kind of like these sex comedies with teenagers and that's what this felt like, but at the beach. So there's the, the main guy, Scotty, he, he's kind of, you know, he's probably a teenager or, you know, 20 or something like that. And he's, he's kind of real smooth with the ladies and he's always picking up lots of women and there's these three middle-aged guys staying at the beach, I assume for the summer, and uh, they're not having any luck with the ladies, so they hire Scotty to help them secure women. In <laughs> um, this movie, like, this, that's like the whole story. There's not a whole lot else going on. There's like Scotty and his girlfriend are having issues and, and whatnot, but like this movie starts out with this just like hugely long beach montage of just like women in bikinis and that that feels like all this movie really is it's like they're just constantly looking for a reason to show uh women in bikinis or topless women it's like every other scene they're just <laughs> you know and and it's just like oh my gosh okay why do they like they they, they, they just tried to use sex to sell this movie and not really anything else. <laughs> uh, there's also a lot of scenes of like, you know, people doing stuff with just music playing and there's no dialogue or anything. I just was like, man, is it, they're almost like montage style things, but a lot of times they weren't montages. They were just like people dancing or people doing whatever. And it just seemed like so many times throughout the movie, they just kept doing that. And I was like, this is weird. <laughs> so this movie's okay. You know, it, it, it doesn't really have a lot to it. Um, the characters are kind of like Scotty is likable. And then, you know, the other guys, you, you, you can kind of relate to the characters. And I, I thought the characters are all right. And they were, they were well acted. There is this like group of, I can't remember what they called them, but like less desirable, <laughs> uh, people. And, uh, I don't know. They were kind of just a little over the top, uh, with, with their delivery, <laughs> but they weren't in it a whole lot. So it wasn't too distracting from the movie. But, uh, yeah, I think this is an okay movie. I think for a score on this one, guys, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, 
please be sure to leave it a like rating where you can find more information including affiliate links to purchase hard bodies in the description below if you haven't already subscribe for more videos check out the videos check out my website bobsmoreview.com and i'll see you guys next time